In this video, we'll be solving a numerical related to the chi-square distribution. So the problem statement says that four coins are tossed 100 times and the following results were obtained. So we have to fit as binomial distribution for the data and test the goodness of fit. So here chi-square of 0 0.05 is given as 9.494, 4 degree of freedom. So these are the values which they have given. Now firstly, let's write the n value. n is equal to 4 because 4 coins were taken. And uh, first, let's write uh, binomial distribution formula because here it, they have said binomial distribution, right? So binomial distribution that is p of x is equal to n c x p of x q n minus x. So in order to solve this question, we require n value x value they have given here then p and q values are required so how will we calculate p and q values so we have one formula that is mu mean is equal to summation of fx by summation of f so you need to multiply these two and then divide it by uh, summation of f that would be equal to np because we know that mean or mu is equal to np for binomial distribution so applying the same thing here so mu is equal to this is equal to np so now solving this part we write mu is equal to 0 plus 29 plus 2 into 36 is 72 plus 25 3 is a 75 plus 4 5 is a 20 by here 5 plus 29 plus 36 plus 25 plus 5 5 plus 29 plus 36 plus 25 plus 5 if you solve this you get 1.9 okay so we have mu is equal to 1.9 is equal to np so n value we know that is 4 so 1.9 by 4 is equal to p so by this we can calculate the p value that is 0 0.49 so if p value is 0 0.49, q would be 1 minus 0 0.49, that is 0 0.51. So we have found the n value, p value and q value. Now let's proceed with the uh, finding out the binomial distribution values or the uh, expected values. So firstly, p of x is equal to, this is the formula. Now we can, we should, we have to rewrite the formula here 100 times. The coins are tossed so we can write it as 100 into n c x p of x q n minus x that is 100 into n value is 4 c x here 0 0.49 to the power x and here uh, 0 0.51 to the power 4 minus x so this is our standard equation So I have put this equation in the calc. Now I will uh, solve it. So solve x value first. Let's write the values first. P of 0, P of 1, P of 2, P of 3 and P of 4 we have to calculate. First let's put the value 0. We get it as 6.7. 7652 which could be rounded off at 7 similarly when we enter 1 we get 26 then for 2 we get 37.47 that is 37 and for 3 we get 24 and for 4 we get 5.76 approx to 6 so we have found out uh, all the binomial distribution values very easily by uh, putting the equation in the calc and then solving it in a very less time or very efficiently. So now let's proceed with formulating a table that is oi and here let's write ei. So let's write the oi values uh, that is observed frequency values which, which we got in the question 5, 29, 36, 25 and 5. Here EI values would be 7, 26, 37, 24 and 6. So chi-square formula is 
summation of i is equal to 1 to 4 y minus e i whole square by y minus e i whole square by e i so here uh, we have to first we have to solve it that is summation of o i minus e i o i minus e i that is 5 minus 7 whole square by e i that is 7 plus 29 minus 26 whole square by 26 plus 36 minus 37 whole square by 37 plus 25 minus 24 whole square by 24 plus 5 minus 6 whole square by 6 so when you solve this you get the value as 1.15 chi square value is 1.15 and uh, the value for reference at 5% level of uh, uh, significance they had given was 9.49 so we can say that chi square value is less than chi square of 0 0.05 so this is the standard case right uh, so here the hypothesis hence the hypothesis that the data follows binomial distribution is accepted here so i hope you have understood how to solve this question if you have any doubt do let me know in the comments and subscribe to my channel thank you